Hello guys. I'm back with another review. As you remember from yesterday. And this time I have Darth Maul and Darth Vader. Two bad guys instead of good guys this time. I'll be reviewing Darth Vader first. Since I just want to get the big one out of the way. Yes, ma'am. Oh, you haven't got them open yet. Not yet. I want to see what it looks like. I just got to go. Okay. Here's the instructions. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry. Your video. There's that. And there's nothing else in the box. Neat. Okay. You might you might be thinking, true. Is one is one more of these coming in? Yes. And you're probably like, what? But, yes. One more of these is coming in. It's Luke Skywalker. Yeah. Here is Darth Vader. He's very bright. You could take off the cape. You could take off the cape very easily. Like, you could put this on, like, Anakin or something like that. You could, but Darth Vader would look weird without a cape. Yeah. And we got this, another thing for my collection. And, of course, we have Darth Vader's cannon. And here we go. There's the first part. And here's some kind of projectile thing that goes on the cannon. Ooh. And Ooh. might seem like a lot of pieces, but it's not. Ooh, this one's a different stand. This one looks interesting. Chisel. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not advertising. You should subscribe to him. But maybe you should. Got the little can of thing. A fine addition to my collection. Now we're putting the Darth Vader thing together. Do they go like this? Yeah. From the front, he looks like a normal Darth Vader, but really, it's long. <laughs> I'll probably do the same thing I did in the review from yesterday, like not put them in the vehicle. Alright, if I can get the hatch open. Ooh! Alright, we got some detail in here. Focus on it, focus on that. Yeah, you can see some stuff in there. We got the cannon, we got the TIE Advance. Yes, I actually got that name correctly. It's a TIE Advance, not a TIE Fighter. I have a pretty good Darth Vader impression. The the number one Darth Vader word that I like to say a lot is what? It's very funny. Alright, let me just move his stuff out of the way. And let me put him there. And then we have Darth Maul. And then we got these two, Boo Bell and Shock Trooper. Yes, I got that name correctly. <laughs> All right, I can't do that. All right, all right, it's too risky. 
Alright, I'll be back. I was just about to pause it like as a YouTube video. That is not a YouTube video. Let's hope this time, like Boo Bell, I don't mess it up. And moon in. Oh man. Crap. I don't know how other people do this. Well, they open the toy before they do the review. So, like, they could do the toy and not the box. Even though I spent like half an hour showing y'all the box. I think the fly might be back. I don't know. If y'all if some of y'all remember the boobell video, you could remember the fly that I had to get rid of. I actually did it. I actually did it. Alright. Let me just snip snip this off. Woo! I actually did it! And I get to keep the background in shape! Ah! Yeah, I think I might get another boo bell just so I can get the background. Great craft. Oh, he did it pink. Alright. Let me get on. Darth Maul. Is Darth Maul? Focus, focus. And here's his weird spider thing. Oh! Could spread them out. This is a very weird one. Probably the weirdest gear class. Ooh, they got these weapons. They got these weapons in. This is season seven from the Clone Wars. All right, so we got Phantom Menace, and then we have Clone Wars season seven. And you can put them together. there and you can put them in the Darth Maul figure individually but I like it double sided and you can put him on it nay and let me gather the garbage so I don't have to go on a little killing spree and that was all of this review. Ooh. Mm, meh. I will okay. say goodbye. Bye-bye.